and welcome to this video. Now this video isn't going to be a live commentary over it um, just because I recorded the clips and got the loots at different times and basically since the SGS stream I've been doing different things at different times basically to get the loot uh, but I'm so happy to announce that I finally have managed to make enough to basically afford the SGS. Now if you guys remember they were rising insanely like over the past two weeks it's gone up like 10 mil so they are um, obviously getting up higher but now luckily they are dropping which is really awesome uh, but before I get into showing you the loot, the money and the SGS I just want to cover a few things real quick Okay, so in the stream, if you remember, if you watched it, I made about 500-ish K from Bandos. So I had to obviously get 3.5 mil left because I was only 4 mil away in the previous episode. So 3.5 mil left to obviously be able to afford it. So what I did was I did some KBD and Black Dragons. Now I went to KBD with my friend Ranger and it was a lot of fun. The only issue was as RS3 is literally like three hours away as I'm recording this. Um, pretty much the servers were going mental, like everything was DCing. I think we DC'd like five times in like uh, the space of like three minutes, so it wasn't the best time to be bossing or trying to do anything like that. We did actually manage to go for one trip, but we must have like DC'd once or twice during that trip, so it was kind of like risky and I didn't really want to risk it. Um, obviously I didn't want to lose my armor, my weapons, stuff like that, and obviously the loot. But yes, we only went for one trip, but I made 183 or 184k I think it was. It was somewhere in the 180s anyway. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I did also end up going to Black Dragons for a bit as well. So basically in the background, just before I forget to tell you guys, like I said, it's not live, it's just some footage that I've recorded uh, just to show you guys what I did. Um, but pretty much, I cannot remember how long I was there for, but I think I managed to get around 200 or 220-ish more like Dragon Slain, so more Dragon Hide and Bones. Now luckily, the Dragon Hide is rising. I think in my last actual episode it was on like 5.1k and now it's on 5.5k so that's really cool and obviously it's going to help a bunch just a little bit extra money uh, but moving on one of the things that you guys have been waiting for over the past few days is the winner of my giveaways so if you don't remember thank you to nerdpocalypse for giving these to me um, to give away to you guys so basically i have a spectral shield giveaway and also a dragon pickaxe giveaway now these videos are both closed now or well, they're still up but you can't comment on them i won't count it all the randomizing has all been done so i think it's about 17 18 mil total for both the items when you price check them and a lot of you guys um entered and took part which is really awesome but the giveaways are now over like i said and i do have the winners of both items so i didn't actually record me doing this because i thought it'd be a lot easier just to integrate it into this video and i was actually going to give away them together but i just decided to split them in half just do uh, the spectral for one person the d-pick for another just because it kind of like increases your chances i guess so basically first off the winner for the spectral spirit shield was tebow 102695 so obviously congratulations to you and the winner of the dragon pickaxe was bazaboy154 so obviously congratulations to both of you guys that's really cool uh, hopefully you enjoy them i will be inboxing you guys um, that i've won it hopefully by the time this video actually goes up so you know we can just discuss when you want to meet up and trade over your goodies um, but yeah um, every now and again i will do more giveaways so if you didn't win this one don't worry about it because there will be more uh, in random times just when i feel like doing a giveaway so obviously just stay tuned for that because i will be doing them quite frequently but like i said rs3 is literally about three hours away and i'm really happy i'm really excited about it uh something that people are saying actually is to put all your armor and stuff in the bank because it's gonna be really laggy or something like that and there's something going on at lumbridge and stuff that's going on i don't actually like i didn't actually hear like the full conversation but they said to like bank all your armor and stuff like that um like i said not too sure what this is about if you guys do know then obviously just let me know in the comments below because i need to know um but yes yeah, so if you do let me know below that'd be awesome but basically i'm gonna miss the eost the eost actually came out around one month after launching this channel when i had like 50 subs and I don't know, it was really fun, obviously like I grew my channel pretty much on EOC, a lot of people obviously didn't like it, because uh, of the change and the stuff like that, but once you get used to it, I like it, I think it was really good, um, let me know if you, like, you guys like it and stuff like that, um, if you're going to miss it, what you're going to miss, what's different, stuff like that, let me know what you think, because I'd obviously love to hear it, and also let me know if you guys are excited for RS3, I'm super hyped, I'm really looking forward to it, I really am, um, and uh, hopefully it's insane as it looks, the interface on the beta looks really awesome, and you guys did actually mention to me that you wanted me to live stream the launch of RS3, and I've been thinking about it, I really do want to, this is the only issue I have at the moment, which I'm hesitating about, is the fact that if it's going to be laggy um because like i said you guys have been telling me it's going to be laggy and stuff so what i might do is probably wait about an hour after rs3 just to sort of see if it is laggy if it is then i probably won't stream i will try my best too i really will um obviously if you guys do want to stream then i'll try my best um even if it's laggy you can still hear the commentary over the top 
but hopefully if I do I'm um, live stream it should be up around 4 p.m. Now that's not 100% yes like I said um, I will let you guys know a little bit later on and you will see the sort of scheduled update but anyway that you see it um, but it does depend like I said how RS3 runs if there isn't a live stream today there will definitely be one tomorrow and hopefully you know the lag doesn't actually it isn't consistent because I really do want to live stream it for you guys show you what it's like and obviously do let me know what you want to see um, like I said because of all the lag and stuff please don't try and tell me to do any bossing stuff like that because I really don't want to like DC and die um, but obviously like, I don't want to lose my new SGS but yeah um, basically like I said just let me know what you want to see if you want me to just speak about the new features and stuff show you some things how I'm going to have my interface set up then just do let me know because I will take all this into consideration and I also can just do a sort of like skilling thing if it is laggy I can just do a bit of skilling and just talk to you guys over it um, but yeah hopefully you guys um, do want to see the stream if you do let me know because that would be pretty cool I'm trying to like do regular streams now if you couldn't already tell uh, but yeah that's pretty much it so now on the screen now you will see that I'm selling my last few bits to get the last hundred like few K I think it was 42.8 mil that I actually landed off with which is really nice um, after selling everything that's really cool and that's from seven episodes of this series so for me being all like newbie and stuff at the beginning and I've gained like 20 levels since then it's not a really a bad effort on my part because I don't know I'm just a noob like I said I can't do like the big boss so it does take quite a long time to make money especially if you're not lucky when you get the drops and stuff like that um, but if you do remember at the beginning of this video I said the SGS was rising but now like I said it's crashing so I actually ended up getting my SGS for 38.1 mil or 38.2 something like that but this is really awesome because it means I have like a pretty much a 4.7 mil extra spare coins for me which is really cool um, obviously that can go towards skilling or something like that um, but yeah that's really awesome I'm super happy that I have it obviously I hope you guys have enjoyed this series for me it's been so fun to do and obviously I've been able to interact with you guys I've been able to like basically get to know you guys cooperate with you do stuff and it's just been really fun hopefully you guys like I said have enjoyed it because like I said it's been awesome for me and if you do want to basically suggest any future series then do leave them in the comments below but bear in mind I'm only level 164 at the moment so just nothing too drastic um, or too hard but yeah so obviously like I said hope you enjoyed it and my new flipping series will be coming out pretty soon I think it's this week I'm going to start making my videos so hopefully you guys will be looking forward to that I know a lot of you guys have been asking me and commenting about that which is really cool but yeah hopefully you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys later